It's 17 incredible 3D printed objects. Beauty the Bald Eagle was shot in the face by poachers, an attack she survived but ultimately left her debilitated. Without her beak, she had virtually zero chances of survival. That's when raptor specialist Jane Cantwell and mechanical engineer Nate Calvin stepped in with a specially designed 3D printed beak prosthetic. With this new beak, Beauty will be able to live a life as if those poachers never attacked her. Speaking of prosthetics for animals, probably one of the most famous cases was made for Derby the dog. Derby was born with deformities in his front legs, which made it hard to impossible for him to be mobile at all. His caretakers even considered euthanization as the only humane option for him. Peace and Paws Dog Rescue discovered Derby and took thousands of CAT scans, which was used to construct special 3D printed prosthetics that allowed Derby to run as far into the hills as his little puppy heart desires. M.C. Escher is known for his impossible drawings and illusions that fool your eyes with 2D drawing tricks. Well, this computer science professor from the Israel Institute of Technology has manipulated these illusions so that they could work as 3D objects. They fool your eye the same way Escher's 2D illusions do in one angle, but if you turn it to the side, you'll see the secret to their trick. This is Irby the world's first 3D printed car. It has humble beginnings as a small project by an independent team of designers at Core Ecologic. The team wanted to design an environmentally conscious and sustainable car that could take a couple of people and their pet from one end to the U.S. to the other on just 10 gallons of fuel. The best way to get this Uber Echo friendly machine was to 3D print all the parts and assemble those. It is one of the greenest cars ever made and a sequel, Irby 2, is in the works. When you think about people who are into 3D printing, you probably imagine a bunch of geeks already. But this might be the epitome of geekdom, and I mean that in the best possible sense. Stephen D. of Crimson's Coscrafts used a 3D printer to make an exact copy of the Dark Knight's gothy armor from the Batman Arkham Origins game. If you think about it, Using expensive technology to make some sick superhero armor is very true to the character for Bruce Wayne. 3D printing is now part of the world of jewelry, and it's not just cutesy plastic novelty jewelry either. Visitors to American Pearl can create and customize a ring or any pearl or diamond you want. Who says 3D printing is just for geeks with niche interests and making prosthetics? 3D printing even gotten its hand into fashion. It's allowed for more daring and impossible looking clothes and pushes the edge of what our clothes and bodies can look like. Designers like Chanel and Carl Lagerfeld are utilizing this technology to create weird, ailing, and exotic looking pieces. While most of these pieces are hanging in the Met and off of models like Dita Von Tees, they could soon be coming out of your personal printer at home, making clothes right out of your home office might just be the next step in fast fashion. You've seen 3D printing make fashion garments and body prosthetics, so it's not too much of a leap to imagine a 3D printed organ. Scientists at Princeton University designed this bionic ear that can actually hear even better than human ears. The 3D printed cells and nanoparticles with a small coil antenna creates this cyber ear that can be installed into a real human and hear radio frequencies in mil a million times higher than our own ears. Jake Evel was a recent graduate of Victoria University when he broke his hand and was stuck with an arm cast that he found archaic. So he designed a cast for the Millennial, a 3D printed, lightweight, washable and breathable. The age old feeling of gross itchiness and suffocation the usual plaster casts come with. Plus, they just look super cool. Try explaining to someone from 10 years ago that NASA funded a 3D printing object to print pizza. Well, that's the reality we're living in today. The company known as BHEX was commissioned by NASA to develop patable food 
for astronauts' deep space journey to Mars. The printer can create specific flavors and toppings and even shapes based on scanned JPEG files to keep those bored astronauts appeased on their years-long journey. Humans aren't scheduled to make any trips to our sister planet until the early 2030s, so we'll probably be seeing these printed pizzas at theme parks and novelty restaurants until then. The shakuhachi flute is a beautiful Japanese flute from the ancient Edo period that is classically made from a bamboo shoot. In 2016, you can now 3D print one out of stainless steel with matte or gold finishes and an intricate dragon design. You can own this ancient instrument for as little as $240. 3D scans of your unborn fetus can be a little confusing to look at or understand. Now, you can get a 3D print of your fetus to hold and touch and see. For as little as $1,275, US dollars, a Japanese company will create a small sculpture with a software called BioTexture. If you're into instruments at all, you're probably aware of Stradivarius violins and string instruments renowned for their well-made instruments. The 3D Various Violins bring that model to the modern age with a slick 3D printed polymer design and funky synthetic sound. While it is based on the Stradivarius violins, its goal was to be its own unique shape and have its own unique sound. Now here's something I'm sure none of us thought would ever exist. A tampon magazine. <laughs> it, it's meant to make you have fun and feel cute storing your tampons in a hyper femme bullet style box, letting you shoot them out whenever you need. It isn't really space efficient or practical, but it's a way to bring something fun into what is arguably the worst time of any lunar cycle. Surgeons and medical practitioners often have to practice procedures on dummy models or cadavers. But as you can imagine, those options are either slightly inaccurate or expensive and a limited resource. Now, with 3D printed models, practice dummies are easier to come by and more accurate, which is great for patients and surgeons alike. When you think about 3D printing, you usually imagine printing little gadgets, life hacks, and little things that make your life easier. If you take that to its logical conclusion, you might wonder if we'll ever have 3D printed buildings and housing. Well, we do, and they were printed and constructed by Winsun in China. These two buildings were constructed from parts entirely made with a specially made 3D printing technology, including the plumbing wiring and entire foundation and now for number one but first be sure to subscribe for new videos every day this camera including the lens was made completely with a 3d printer and it actually works camera lenses are made from either acrylic or sandblasted resin and it has all the moving parts that allow you to change aperture load and unload film the photos that come from this 3d printed camera aren't exactly crisp or super pristine but they have a dreamy quality about them that you wouldn't expect to come out of a handcrafted camera